On Mother's Day 2019, I had essentially it was kind of a freak accident. I walked into a pole, but I'm kind of klutzy, so that wasn't that much of a surprise. I didn't really think much of it, except for about two days later, I started to feel really nauseous. I started throwing up and I lost consciousness. I promptly took myself to, you know, my local ER where they diagnosed me with a concussion. They did some tests, but they thought it was just a concussion and my condition deteriorated pretty quickly. All my senses were affected. I had a hard time remembering things. I couldn't find the right words for things. And I ultimately even had to go to some physical therapy because I forgot how to like swing my arms when I walk. I had a hard time reading. I would lose my place. I couldn't focus. Everything was difficult. I couldn't figure out how to do things. I couldn't go to the grocery store because I would just wander around for hours. I couldn't figure out um, like what aisle I needed, even though I could read what the aisle said. And if I got on the aisle, I couldn't find what I needed. So I couldn't drive for about eight months. My reaction times were just too slow. So my life changed radically. Things were slipping away and I could tell they were slipping away. Um, sensory stuff, cognitive stuff, um, physical stuff, and emotional. It was, and to hear that I needed to maybe just, like if this was gonna be my life now, was just a, a gut punch. It was horrible. I was at a point where I was pretty hopeless, but I wanted hope. I didn't want to give up hope. And even though when I initially kind of looked up the Mind Eye Institute and Dr. Zelensky and looked at the website, even though I didn't necessarily understand maybe their testing methods and everything, I was desperate. And I thought, you know what, I've got to exhaust all avenues and I felt like I was running out of time if I wanted to try to get as much of myself back as I could. And my first appointment, it felt like it lasted <laughs> forever. I think it lasted probably a half day. Essentially, Dr. Z has created this amazing test that helps her to pinpoint your visual deficits. She helped me explain what had happened as essentially if there were a bunch of highways going through my brain. Some were under construction and some were now dead ends. And our job was to build new highways to go around the congestion and to get around the dead ends. And essentially our goal was, you know, neuroplasticity, which is, you know, your brain essentially <laughs> working again or finding new ways to work. Now I look back and I go, I can go to a grocery store. I can actually go to a movie. I can drive. I don't freak out if something comes up on my right peripheral side because that is um, a deficit for me. My focus is amazing. Like I could sit down and actually read a book from start to finish now. And just kind of my sense of self. It's hard to explain to people when you've had a brain injury. It's kind of like you're soulless and it makes, I feel more like myself than I have since I got hurt.